Thank you for joining us tonight. After a successful effort removing James Madison's name from Memorial High School, the Madison School Board is starting the process of removing another. Yeah, they met tonight about Thomas Jefferson Middle School right next door to Memorial. Brad Hamilton joins us now in studio after watching tonight's special school board meeting. Brad? Eric and Charlotte, tonight the school board selected a committee which will evaluate that possible name change. It is a similar method that was used in the process to replace James Madison's name and might have the same result. Last month, Thomas Jefferson Middle School's principal read a letter from the school community asking for change. Tonight, the process for that change, removing Thomas Jefferson from their school's name, begins. As after very little discussion... All those in favor? Aye. The school board voted unanimously in favor of creating a committee to discuss a possible name change. Any opposed? Any recusal? The reason for this name change is likely linked to the fact that Jefferson owned about 600 slaves and has even been linked to sexually abusing Sally Hemings, whom he owned from the time she was a child. It's leaving parents like Dan Kramer open to that change. It's supposed to be reflective of the community. If the community thinks that uh, it's time for a change, then I'm okay with that. Like anything else, there are going to be folks who disagree with Kramer's belief, but for him, it's not going to affect what matters most, his child receiving her education. This is a public school. Uh, it's meant to represent the community that it's in, so I really don't have a problem with any name change. They could change it every year for all I care. There is no exact timetable for when this change may happen, but we're going to continue to keep you updated as that develops.